I am Dr. Sri Ram Ramalingam, ophthalmologist, medical director, and chairman, practicing at Pradhya Netralay, Artinagar, specialized in pediatric ophthalmology, glaucoma, and cataract. Eye holes, or what is called as intraocular lenses, are medical devices that are implanted in the eye after a cataract surgery. There are various types of intraocular lenses. First, based on the material that is being used to manufacture them, they are called as hydrophilic material, which attract water, hydrophobic material, which repel water, and silicon material. Silicon material is not available now. The most commonly used intraocular lens material is hydrophobic material. Now, the hydrophobic materials is the one most commonly used, but in this, there are various types of lenses that are available. The lenses may be in the form of what is called as a monofocal lens, aspheric intraocular lenses, toric intraocular lenses, or multifocal intraocular lenses. Monofocal or spherical intraocular lenses is the most commonly used lens. These lenses are easy to manufacture and are quite commonly implanted in the eye. Aspheric lenses are what is called as a premium intraocular lenses. The aspheric lenses, unlike a spherical lenses, which has got a uniform curvature, here the aspheric lenses, the curvature varies from the center to the periphery. This variation mimics the natural human lens. Human lens is an aspheric intraocular lens as against the spherical intraocular lenses. So, uh, aspheric lenses matches a natural human lens that is implanted into the eye. Now, while implanting a spherical intraocular lenses, it can lead to minor optical imperfections. These are called as an higher order abrasions. But when implanting an aspheric intraocular lenses, these are taken care of. So, a person with an aspheric intraocular lens inside the eye will have a crisp clear vision. They have got a better night vision as against a spherical intraocular lens. Some of the aspheric intraocular lens come with what is called as a yellow chrome lenses. These are what is called as a blue blocking lenses. These prevent the harmful blue light from entering into the eye and prevent damage to the retina from the harmful blue light. The other type of lens is what is called as a toric intraocular lenses. Occasionally, person with a pre-existing astigmatism, if only either a monofocal lens is used, their existing astigmatism may be still present and they may not get a sharp, clear vision. In order to correct the pre-existing astigmatism, one needs to implant what is called as a toric intraocular lens. Your surgeon will do the measurement and decide whether you require a toric intraocular lenses or not. If a person requires a toric intraocular lenses, the measurements are taken and the lenses are ordered prior to the surgery. During the surgery, your surgeon will mark the axis where the lens has to be placed and during the surgery, the lens is aligned to the axis to give a clear sharp vision. The other type of lenses are what is called as a multifocal lenses. As the name suggests, it, corrects, it has got multiple foci, it has got multiple rings. It may be what is called as a bifocal lenses. Bifocal lenses correct the distance and the, inter and the reading vision. Another type of lens is what is called as a trifocal lenses. As the name suggests, trifocal. One can see distant objects, one can see intermediate distance while working on the system and one will have a clear vision for reading also. So these are the different multifocal lenses. The, special, the multifocal lenses needs to be implanted in both the eyes within a gap of a few weeks. It takes some time for the brain to adjust to the multifocal lens. We usually say the person start, needs to relearn how to start seeing. That is, all images are present at the same time in the eye. One needs to choose what one needs to see. So it's better if both the eyes are done simultaneously or within a gap of few weeks so that the brain is easier to adjust. Occasionally, patients with multifocal lenses can complain of halos or glare, especially during night. And as time progresses, this also decreases. 
the newer advances in multifocal lenses these glare and halos have decreased the other type of lenses what is called as an accommodative intraocular lenses which is not very commonly available in india where like a normal human lens or person is able to accommodate that is the haptic the wings of the lens are able to mold the lens either forward or backward so these are called as accommodative lenses these are available else uh, abroad but it is not commonly available in india now what is the best lens for me depends upon you and also the surgeon who is operating on you not all lenses are suitable for every patient the surgeon will have a chat with you depending upon your requirements depending upon your activity depending upon your day to day life a surgeon will choose the best lens available need not be that the best quality lenses is the best suitable for you the lens the surgeon is the best person to choose what is the best lens for you